My name is Olga Sadowska. I'm the Vice Chair of Russian NGO Committee Against Torture and a member of Executive Council of OMC team. Today we're present at the presentation of periodic report by Russian Federation and yesterday we had an informal briefing with CAT members and rapporteurs on the issues that human rights defenders wanted to raise. Uh, regarding the situation in Russian Federation and how it was developing for the last six years. Um, the report, the official report of the Russian Federation was, was not so interesting because it actually didn't contain any um, reliable, reliable information that can help to evaluate the prevalence of torture in the country because we don't have available data on this, separate available data on torture prevalence in, in the country. But still we managed to analyze the report and to find certain discrepancies, lies and um, mis misinformation that we, uh, and we presented our concerns to, to the members of the committee. The delegation of Russian NGOs was their representatives and they represented different types of NGOs working in North Caucasus, working with domestic violence, with drug users, with LGBTI people, victims of police abuse, uh, people that represent demonstrators that do, who, who were beaten during police raids. Um, so, and we tried to raise as many important questions as we could and we're very satisfied with the level of uh, involvement of the committee in the, Russian in the Russian situation because the list of the questions that were raised today during the, during the session were very well prepared, the questions were very detailed, they were addressing not only the legislation but the law enforcement practice that is very important when it comes to Russia because the legislation in the country is more or less okay and adequate but the law enforcement practice is um, absolutely not meeting any international standards and standards of European Court of Human Rights. There were questions about certain cases like harassment against human rights defenders, like pressure on the represent representatives of the victims, tortures in prisons, and uh, systematic questions like institutions that should investigate torture crimes, institutions that should supervise the conditions of detentions, uh, public institutions that should have access to the prisons and we are looking forward to tomorrow uh, session where Russian Federation will reply to the questions and report on the fulfillment of their recommendations of, of CAT.